What's up, YouTube? This is the Billy Bob HD bringing you another Let's Play. Today, I've got some more Victoria 2, Heart of Darkness. We are playing as Ukraine. Last episode, Austria grabbed a big chunk of territory over this way, out from under the North German Federation, which was pretty significant um, because Schleswig over here was also uh, released as part of that whole deal um, as an independent state. We also declared war on Egypt at the very end of last episode, so we have already ordered our army to go ahead and move down into Cairo and try to occupy Cairo, so we'll see how that goes. And through the process of declaring war on Egypt to totally annex them, uh, their ally Hedjaz over here also joined, so we may have to invade them in order to um, finish out the war. So, let's take a stack and do just that. I've got my little fleet here over in Odessa, just enough to bring over some men. And we'll load up the boats and we'll take them over to Hedjaz. So let's do that. Uh, get on the boats, excellent. Uh, our military just got a boost in morale, so that's good. Military statistics, that um, actually helps out my organization as well, so we'll go ahead and do that. All right. So now that we've got, uh, I think it's 15,000 men or so, more than that actually, we're going to head down over here to Head Jazz. Oh, really? So this is saying I have to actually go all the way around the Horn of Africa, which sucks. Um, do I have the ability to build the Suez Canal yet? No. So I expect that to be coming a little bit later in the campaign. How is the occupation of Cairo going? Good. So we are... Um, we are taking some attrition. I hope that my transport ships actually make it around the Horn of Africa there. I don't see why not. Oh, we've actually got a Commonwealth of Segal here, which is independent. However, they report up to the French. Don't normally see that. Uh, you can see the Germans really active in Africa as well. And we are colonizing... We're colonizing down here this little section, if I can show you guys, let's see. Yeah, this green, this whole green area here. Troubles brewing that North German Federation has decided to back Romania in the current crisis, and so, of course the Germans are going to support that because Austria took a bunch of their territory here recently, so they're going to try to get the rest of the great powers to jump in on that shit. Um, we can go ahead and create the protectorate here, excellent. And now the question becomes, I really only have one more move left. Um, damn it, I, I picked military statistics for my next research, and we definitely should have taken the naval research to boost my naval bases there. Um, let's go ahead and take this one, just so I can get another port in Africa here, in, uh, in uh, West Africa. In Congo, so we'll do that. All right, let's unpause it yet again here. Okay, Cairo has now been occupied. We'll go into the Giza area here next. Where is my fleet? You're showing his red. He's taking some attrition. That's not good. Lose one militancy. Lose two militancy. But it kills off all the pops, so I don't want to do that. Army organization plus two and a half percent. I like that shit. Uh, shit, I hope he's able to make it all the way across here. If we lose these men, I'm going to be pissed. They're at 34%. Uh, can they dock in a friendly port, maybe? No, I don't have any friendly ports in between here and there. So we may lose that. We may lose them, guys. Um, do I have steam transports yet? No, I don't. I really have to beef up the naval stuff, too. Um, go over here to Tanta. I've been super busy with other stuff, trying to build up the industry, all of that good stuff. We're currently ranked number 10 in the world, mainly due to my military power. So here they come now. Okay, no attrition on this coast of Africa, so that's what I like to see. I think we may just barely make it. Gain 5.5 prestige? Hell yeah, I'll take that. 
We are approaching the great powers now, though, in the overall score, so that's... That's really fun. Oh, I do have a uh, rebellion that's popped up there in Cairo against my occupation. Doop, doop. Intervene immediately, so a lot of people pissed off in... Uh... How is Germany able to reach that? Oh, no, it's France. Okay. I thought that was Germany for a second. All right. Good there, good there. All right, unload the boats. Can I unload you anywhere? Excellent. Yes, they will unload there in the mountains. Perfecto. Mobilization size plus 1%. percent like to see that. We'll take this 27 stack now and quell that rebellion. Army organization plus 5 there. If I go back over to Navy, let's go to the Raider Group Doctrine. It's going to allow me to boost up my naval base a little bit further. And now we are uh, starting to occupy Head Jazz as well. So once we occupy that, I'll park my boats here in that port and hopefully they will start to repair themselves. Come back over here, knock those guys out. Awesome. Uh, let's take Alexandria now. Once we've done that, we will have to march them sort of all the way down this way. We do have a couple armies here in the south that are um, causing some problems too in the southern colonies. Uh, losing shitloads of money right now just because we're financing the war. Are these all infantrymen? Yes, they are. Taking 2% attrition. Okay, Alexandria. Come on. We've got some shit to deal with in the south. Uh, Spain now asking for military access, which I will deny. We have okay relations with them. Oh, I wonder if that crisis popped off because... No, they didn't. North German War of Romanian Freedom. That is the crisis that popped off. So you've got Austria, France, Spain, and Russia up against the Germans and British, which... Heh, hate it for the Germans, but it looks like they're going to get overrun again. You can see Austria moving heavily to the north here and Russia moving in with them as well from east to west. God, have we occupied that yet? Yes, we have. So come on down here. We'll fight this little six stack for the Hedjaz army. I wonder if that was all they were able to put together towards this. Not sure. Okay, that is now occupied. So I will dock my boats there home at the port. Good deal. Ukrainian anarcho-liberals have risen. Holy crap. Pause. Okay, that's not super duper concerning. Um, I'm going to take this stack here and put you on automatic rebel hunt so you can uh, try to take care of that shit for me. Thank you. So they'll knock out those guys over time. And this army, yes, marching through the desert, unfortunately, down here. Let's have you actually end up trying to fight them there. Hopefully we make it before the occupation finishes off for that uh, province. God, and another another three stack has popped in now. Um, are these guys repairing themselves? Hopefully. We won. We won. That's what I like to see. Okay, there's the rest of the rebellions for you. I don't want to take the ships back home to home port, though, because... Experience. Not very experienced. Well, no shit. Organization strength is low as well. I don't have a repair option there to help out with that. Okay. Oh, and we're missing the protectorate here. Fuck, the Germans are going to beat me to it, it looks like. I did not pay attention. But we did boost up our colonial power there to fight against that. Um, hopefully, hopefully we can uh, grab that little chunk. All right, let's go down here now. The six stack will go away. I'll run over here, get rid of this two stack. The naval, ba the naval base plus one is now completed, but Africa is pretty much taken up. So I'm almost wondering if I need to shift, uh, well... 
we can start with the steamers because once we build capital ships, that helps my prestige as well. Like if we were able to roll out a couple battleships or something like that. All right, here comes the guy down. He's only got point to um, attrition, so I'm not feeling horrible about that or anything. Organization just popped through. Yeah, the Germans are going to beat me to this. That sucks. And I can't colonize over here. The naval range is too much. It's barely too much. All right, you guys come back down here. We'll take this other mountainous region, and then we'll move into Mecca and colonize Mecca as well. Okay, so they retreated out. They're going to try to run from me yet again. Hopefully we can get there before they actually do anything about it. You little fuckers, come back. Um, are they running from me yet again? Yes, they are. Got some additional or army organization there. It's always good to see. Upgrade our settlement level there. I'm not going to give it to the I'm not going to hand it over to the Germans without a fight here. And yeah, he's now on the road there, occupying up here. So he's trying to, uh, we should get there before he moves. Fucking A. So now we've pinned him up here. What is this? In Wadai. Uh, Head Jazz now offering a piece out. A white piece, I will take that. I don't have the infamy space to annex them either. So now it's just dealing with Egypt, so we'll march over here, because they're trying to occupy me over here, and we also need to pick a new research, so point defense system looks good to me. We'll go ahead and pick that. And we can also focus now, I see they're already up to a level 2 guard post there, and I can't, uh, fuck. Looks like the Germans will take that over. Um, and now we've got North German Africa as its own state. So uh, Germany has released North German Africa. They are still in the German sphere and a satellite, but I wonder if that occurred from the war that was over. <laughs> Austria did take some additional territory too, these chunks. Wow, this is one of the strongest Austrias I've seen so far. We're losing the race in the Congo, no doubt. Should we just go ahead and withdraw, I'm wondering. Hmm. Nah, we'll piss off the Germans a little bit further. Okay, so come down here and finish off this one stack for me, please. Mobilization size plus one, so march north now into the rest of this Egyptian-held territory, and that should... Oh, fucking A. Yeah, we do have some guys still that are rebelling there in uh, Giza. Okay, okay. Stream transports, would like to see. So, oh, wait, 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 wait. Can these guys march back? Yes, they can. So we'll send them back to the home territory there. Fish production plus 50%. Can never have enough fish. How many of you guys like to eat fish? Do you like fish sticks? Do you like fish sticks in your mouth? Okay, we won. Oh wait, come right here. Yeah, 15 stack, you're gonna help me clear out these rebellions so we can finish off this war. My infamy continues to burn off at 18 there. Okay, so we've immediately got our shit back and come back over here to Cairo and liberate that, please. Let's make sure that we haven't lost any alliances or anything, we have not. Russia, Sweden, Netherlands, and Serbia. Still my allies there. And yeah, the Egyptians are not liking this. They are rebelling pretty fucking hard. There we go. They have been taken care of. We'll let those guys sort of heal up a little bit. And then lastly, let's see if they'll take a piece now. Propose peace. Annex Egypt. It looks like they will take this, so we will proceed. Boom. 
All right, so that solidifies our holdings in Africa. That's what we've been able to do. Germany, um, Germany proper, I guess I should say, still owns all of these t little territories, though. All right, so I don't want you guys to waste away in the desert, so move back up here, and you guys will go ahead and sit in Cairo for me. Um, I may go ahead and just leave this 15 stack for now until we can rebuild the Navy. I don't know if they're going to be able to make it home or not. We will find out. Oh, we can also build a shitload more. Yeah. I'll get some Dragoons going in Africa, too. There we are. Uh, we could use a couple of Dragoons in Europe and a couple of artilleries. We can also lower my maintenance. Here we go. Wow, still losing a ton of money. Uh, we are paying almost 100 a month in subsidies for the industry, so that's part of it, too. Let's update our artillery to the Iron Breach Loaded. Excellent. Organization plus two and a half. There we are. Okay, and then... God, what should we cut spending in elsewhere? I guess I could cut down the military spending by, by about a hundred. There we are. Just to get that back to the positive, and... My taxes are pretty fucking high as it is. Here we go. Don't want to tax the rich that badly. Now we're making good money again. I can actually... Yeah, I'm going to slide that back up just to get back to the positive there. Alright, so now... I'm guessing we can actually go ahead and create our colonies. Since Africa is pretty much done up. There's one. We will go to colony here. Colony here. Colony there there and I think is that it yes that is all so maybe we can uh, create a sub state eventually we build some industry down there and totally industrialize Africa which would be that'd be pretty fun okay three um, consciousness I don't like to take I don't like to take militancy because it just it, it eggs on the uh, the rebellions right Okay, we can now build a Commerce Raider. Navy Speed plus one. This is now an 18 stack, so I will go like that to consolidate you. Okay, here's the other these other random stacks in Africa now that are popping out of the woodwork. Move you guys up here. To, I just want to consolidate everything right now. Yeah. There we are. Okay. Yeah, those guys are marching up there. Okay, good. Now, how about in Europe? Um, I guess I've got an auto selection here. Yeah, okay, so those guys are going to pop in there and automatically create a new stack for me. Austria, man, where are you guys ranked now? Number six, just behind the Germans. That may be their ceiling. I was never able to get Austria above like a six in my playthroughs. All right, we're sort of we're overconsumed on military now as well, and we're losing some cash due to the industrial subsidies. Let's go check that out. Yeah, I've got good pops in all of my factories, except in the Crimea here, where we've got a small arms factory that's coming up. Request military access from Ethiopia. No thanks. All right. New artillery. We should get back on some of this indust industrial research here. Uh, what if I got a commerce? Actually, yeah. Since we're having money problems at the moment, let's get the investment banks done. But in order to do that, we're going to need the re extra research points to do that, too. So we'll grab that too. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Again, this has been the Billy Bob HD. Please remember to like, subscribe, and or comment if you've enjoyed my content. And we'll catch you next time.